Hi guys, thanks for joining me today in a new video. So today's video is going to be another pastel drawing. Who would have guessed? <laughs> um, I'm really into pastels at the moment and especially these kind of surrealistic style um, drawings. I really feel like I can put my ideas and my, my feelings and my thoughts into them. So I recorded this video about two days ago um, at midnight because I usually get all my inspiration at midnight so I just figured I turn on my daylight lamp and start recording right away so the basic idea was to do a galaxy night sky type of drawing with a planet um, I've done a drawing like this before it was a winter scene and since then I feel like I have really improved so I figured I'd do a drawing like this again and yeah see how much my technique has improved with pastels so all the materials I'm using I list in the description so if you are curious just check it out below and I also want to take some time to answer some frequently asked questions here on my YouTube channel about pastel drawing because I get a lot of questions about it and I can't answer them all um, because I just don't have enough time but I'll um, pick the most asked ones and answer them here now so the first one is if you can do these type of drawings with oil pastels as well um, if you don't have soft pastels at home and I don't know if I can really answer that question because I have never used oil pastels. So I am not sure, but oil pastels don't work like soft pastels. You can't blend them with your finger that well. Um, soft pastels are really good for these type of drawings and I don't think oil pastels are. If you really want to do drawings like this, um, I would recommend to get soft pastel sticks instead of oil pastel sticks. So another question that I get a lot is how I do the stars in these drawings. And the answer is basically very simple. I just take a white pastel stick or a very light blue one and I tap it um, on the paper. So then you get the effect of stars. It's really simple. You can also use paint for it. But I figured this would be the most easy way to, uh, to do the stars. So I just tap on my paper with a white pastel or a light blue one. And the last question is... What paper do I use? I get this question so often. Um, I switch papers. Um, but lately I've really been into Pastel Matte by Claire Fontaine. I have also used Canson Mitan's paper. I feel like Pastel Matte is a lot more useful when you want to layer a lot of colors. And it's also much better for detail. So. I really like Claire Fontaine Pastel Matte. I do always list my materials in the description. So if you have a question about my materials, please check the description first because I always list it there. So I really hope you like how this drawing turned out. Um, in the end, I decided to add those little light bulbs hanging from the tree. So yeah, that's basically it. I hope you liked this video. I hope you liked how the drawing turned out. If you have a title for it, let me know in the comments. And this drawing will be for sale in my Etsy shop. So um, there's a link in the description as well. So if you're interested, you can find it there. I'm also planning to get prints of this drawing. And I'm also on Patreon. So if you want to become a supporter over on Patreon, there's a link for that in the description as well. So check that out. You would really help me um, by becoming a patron. I'm still working on my 
on my Patreon account, but yeah, I do have some fun plans for it coming up. So yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video and don't forget to subscribe and leave a like and leave a comment. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.